everybody and welcome to this month's tutorial and I want to teach you the big lunge into planche and attitude balance a very common set of movements usually done at the end of the rang jam à terre combination or in my class after the fondue there are different versions of course so we'll see what we can modify for us for different levels So how are we going to begin? We'll have the left hand at the bar and we're going to angle towards the bar. So we are in a pulmon, arm first and second. The inside leg, the left leg, tendu to the back. We start with an allongé. Now in this pose, we're going to slide down into a long line from the top of the head to the tip of the toe. The arm can go to first, or into fifth position. What's really important is to keep the foot pointed so that we can slide down and up on it. The moment you relax the foot, you get stuck. You also want to ideally slide on the side of your big toenail, not so much on the top. So you want to maintain the turnout. Possibly you have to move the leg a little bit to the side. Allongé, lift the chest, stay in that shape to slide down. Often people go down with the shoulders and stay up with the bum. One long line. Now push the floor down with the sole of the foot, holding or engaging your piriformis, your turnout muscle, to have the power to push yourself back up. Arm um, goes to fifth. Now we're having a cambre, a back bend. You want to have no weight on the back foot, a very long leg, and you want to stretch away from your leg, away from the floor, towards the upper corner of the room. Option one, to return, to bring the arm to arabesque, lifting the arabesque, lifting the arm, doing the planche. Option two, coming from the back bend into the planche immediately, maintaining your shape, the leg leads, and pushing your forward into the planche position. Let's talk about that. Six o'clock in the ideal situation, 
six o'clock shape. You'll have your arabesque. Nothing changes anymore. My arabesque is no longer high, nor is my attitude like it used to be when I was young, strong and flexible and also a few pounds lighter, so there was nothing in the way. However, whatever your height is here or here or already up there, nothing changed. The shape of your spine and your leg remains. What happens now is the mechanics over your hip joint. Imagine your hip joint is a baseball and you have a baseball glove. That's how my teacher Renato used to explain it. And you slide over that hip. This is the movement of the planche. I have the image of a pillar. On top of the pillar is a boat and it rocks front and back. You are the boat, your leg is the pillar. Yeah, maintain your back bend in the upper back. The thigh pushes into the mechanics. If nothing happens here anymore, your hamstring may be too short or you can't get a higher leg in the back, you must stop here, I'm afraid. You cannot not lift the leg and continue with your upper body. You really need to maintain that shape. It's a smiley face through the spine into the arabesque. Further, you want to maintain the one line from your fingertips to your toenails. You're reaching them apart actively. From here, see my fingertips, see my toes, they're reaching away from each other. I want to keep my leg where it is to return with the opposite back muscles up. I bend the knee and my elbow away from each other, rising up. I try to balance either here or I get it all the way up. Circle the arms into allongé, extend the leg and close. The circle of the arms happens, the upper arm remain, the forearm circles down, then reaching into a high allongé. The moment the arm allonges, the leg extends. And then you can stretch out your back because it's really stressful on the body. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, please like and subscribe and share with your Bali Buddies. Please also leave comments or questions below the video and you can also buy me a coffee. The link is in the comments below if you find this video very helpful. If you have any questions, please do let me know. I promise I will get back to you. Thank you for watching. Wait. Bye for now. Hey Herbert, is that your place now? Is that your place? You want to say hello? Do you want to say hello? You're purring into my microphone. Bye for now. If you would like to join my classes online or at Pineapple, go to holisticbali.com slash schedule or pineapple.uk.com. And if you have any questions, please get in touch.